Norwegian are flying high, now the third largest low-cost airline in Europe and since 2014 the only to branch out across the Atlantic with a fleet of Boeing 787 Dreamliners. At 97%, Norwegian has a load factor that legacy airlines would dream of too. But Norwegian may not be the first port of call for many wanting to fly between Europe and North America. Yes, that's true. I think a lot of people have a preconception that we don't fly direct, but we actually do. We are providing lots and lots of affordable fares in the market for UK passengers to fly all over the USA. And we want people to think of us first. So when it's time to go to the USA and you need to fly affordably, why not fly Norwegian? The pop-up at Westfield Stratford City has seen thousands of shoppers make a virtual Atlantic dash with the help of Norwegian and Boeing. By wearing VR headsets, participants can experience 360 degree views, the sounds and motion of a Norwegian Boeing 787 flight in economy and premium cabins from the UK to the USA. So stretch out, lean back and enjoy your flight. We're a fast growing airline. We've already doubled our long-haul passengers in the last year and going into 2017 we'll be increasing by 55%, uh, giving more affordable fares to the UK passengers. And it's really important in that context to be able to showcase exactly why low cost can also give you high quality and using a high quality medium like this event was the best way our partner, Boeing, and ourselves thought was, was the best way to do that. But just how successful has this pop-up been? And how can a low-cost carrier like Norwegian justify this kind of marketing expenditure? Well, for us, it was very important that it was at capacity, that it was a popular choice for people to spend 15 minutes with us. And, and we've certainly achieved that. Uh, and the high number of people that we've had through also will have further contact with those people to be able to further engage them in the great offers that we have. Um, and So you do get registration details. There, there was a CRM issue here. There, there's a CRM element here. Um, but more importantly for me, uh, the return on investment really showcased its, itself when we uh, see how we can use this over and over again. Um, the objective for us is to showcase how great it is to fly with Norwegian and that is something, an objective that we have in the UK, which we can use this again for, or um, in Spain and in France and other markets where we're launching uh, new flights to the USA. Well, we're fast growing and we're always going to have to demonstrate this point. With an aggressive expansion plan for the coming years, expect more innovative experiences to engage potential passengers. The future for Norwegian is, uh, is we're growing really fast and we're going to need to continue to find ways to immersively and creatively raise awareness and brand. Still watching? Perfect. Click here to watch another great video from CNBC International. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.